Well, today was good, but today also sucked. My hand is, I think it's from doing all that stuff yesterday. My hand hurts today. It's been hurting pretty bad all day. So I pretty much just laid around all day. That was it. But I did make the phone call to the uh, new place that got built there a couple years ago. And they said, for the new patient, they're like, you know, everybody's like booked out to like December for new patients. Well, and they have to do a phone call first. I'm like, well, like a pre, a pre screening or whatever, like phone call questions. And then when you do the visit after that, well, then the lady just got all excited real quick. She's like, it looks like somebody canceled and we have an opening tomorrow at 8.30 a.m. And she's like, well, we can get a phone call at 2 p.m., but we have to do them before. So she got a hold of the lady that's going to call, and she was just hoping that she could squeeze me in sometime today. So she ended up getting on the phone. She was like, John, I think I can call you about 1.45 to like 2.30-ish. I think I can squeeze you in there to get that done. And uh, she called me, knocked it out in like 10 minutes, and uh, now I have my new patient in their visit at 8.30 instead of waiting until December. Well, Mom said, she's like, it's only you and your luck. She's like, I don't know how you do it. You have the luck of the Irish or something. But, yeah, then I took like a two-hour nap on the recliner. Hannah's still hurting pretty darn good. But Hannah's going to be home here in 30-ish minutes. I wanted to come out and blow my trailer out. But I realized I can't get it started because I don't have a hand. And then we always, I need to blow up top there first. And I'm not going to be able to... Because I usually have to use one arm to push down as I'm crawling around and do that. So I can't even blow it up here to go down there. I'm not going to blow all this out without getting this done first. So now I'm just going to have to wait for Hannah to get home so she can take the leaf blower over there and blow that out. And then I can blow out the bottom rest of it and maybe get the trailer parked where it, where it goes. I just want to, you know, it's going to kill me if I don't get some kind of something accomplished today. Some kind of productivity. So... It's been really bugging me all day. So I figure that will satisfy my need for getting, feeling accomplished. I don't know why, but I think it was from unloading everything and getting all the laundry done and just everything we did. Everything I did, because it was just feeling so good. I think it was just hot and getting home and just really just trying to knock all that stuff out in my stubbornness that I got to my limit because like I feel each part the gash on the back and between my index fingers and my broken fingers like all of it hurts so I'm gonna try to do that and get that back so I can get the trailer off the truck and unload it from the suspension <sighs> so much fun right this is gonna kill me only doing limited stuff. I feel like I get more of a range and more things I can do, but then I do more what I think I can and then find out the next day that I can't. <sighs> Slowly but surely, it'll be going. So that's probably the end of my day. And then maybe making some dinner and having Hannah help me shower and that'll be it. So you might get something else, you might not. It was A day that I needed, not a day that I wanted.